Yes, yes, greatest country in the world. We should be proud to live here, but we should, maybe we need to earn our right to live here almost. Maybe we've welcomed a shining star as a citizen into this, I say, finalmente, what took so long. Our newest Canadian citizen uh, taking the oath this week, Mike Pinball Clemens and his wife Diane. Yay! Congratulations, our newest Canadians before a judge on Tuesday. Uh, he had to be very quiet, but the news did break yesterday. And they're both friends to us here on Breakfast Television, so he got up super early with a busy schedule. And he's live on the phone. Good morning, Michael. Good morning, Dina. Good morning, Kevin. How are you this morning? Uh, shame on you, Mike, for not telling us about this. I would have been there front row center clapping. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> our, our challenge is we want to make it special for everybody. Nice and of you. So we didn't want to sort of try to hog anything. There were 61 of us including Diane and myself and and uh, so we, it was a nice small ceremony and everybody was equally represented so it was wonderful. How Canadian of you to be so humble and I think I detect more of a Canadian accent in Michael right now. <laughs> Tell me why now? Why did it take so long? I always feel like you were Canadian. Uh, you know I, it, it was one of those things in the beginning where I already felt Canadian so it, it wasn't a big deal and I, then I, I just got to the point where I want, yeah, there, there was something in me that said, you know, I, I really want this to be official. And, and um, so, so we went ahead and we reached out and, and we tried to do it before uh, the 100th Grey Cup. They were going to do yeah. a, a special yeah. ceremony. Yeah. And uh, uh, we weren't able to get things together in time and it didn't happen, but it has happened now. So we, we're so excited about it. Okay, Mike, some quick questions for you that were not on the test. Uh, is there such a thing as ketchup chips? Uh, there is yes. uh, such a thing as ketchup. There we go. Yes. Um, uh, what is a double double? Uh, that is two sugars, two creams. There you go. All right, so he is Canadian. Well, I'm just going to say this with Diane and Michael, now Canadian citizens, this country just got brighter, more beautiful, with a big old heart, and welcome officially. Congratulations, Mike. Thank you. Congratulations. We're so grateful to, uh, to be in this country, and, and uh, you know, people often uh, celebrate us for, for uh, our contributions, but this country has done much more for, for us than we can ever do for it, and we, we are uh, peacock proud. As, as, uh, I love uh, it. Might, we might. Mm -hmm. okay. um, Dean and I are about to take the test, but oh, I just want to do a quick shout-out because I'm working with Mike tomorrow at the Friends of We Care Gala at the International Center, all in support of Easter Seal. So I look forward to seeing you there Is tomorrow, it sold my friend. Can people sign in? Sign up? I'm not sure. You can okay. go to the Friends of We Care website. So I'll see you and, tomorrow, my friend. And, and if you're looking for phenomenal, uh, really phenomenal Canadians, that's the place to be. All right. Stay thank peacock you. proud, my friend. See you soon. All right. Thanks so much. Okay, team. Thank you. Great talking He's to so you. Sweet. So. They, when, when someone becomes a citizen who is not from this country, they have to study and they have to learn about this country. There is no prerequisite, really, that any Canadian really needs to know about the country. That's I mean, right. you learn it in school, you can you pass or fail. It. If you fail history, doesn't matter, you're still a Canadian. I mean, that's good and bad in some... You have the memory of an elephant, I have the memory of a sieve, and now you're going to put us to the test? So we, this is what we're going to do. We have some sample questions, not gonna go and up. our game show host over here, Brad C. Smith, will be... Uh... <laughs> He's got the perfect pearly whites to play the game show host. <laughs> All right, Brad. Sing. Kevin, could you pass the Canadian citizenship test? Yes. <laughs> question number yes. one. Okay, that, that was the team. question? Let's be a team. I haven't seen these Canadian. Yet. I'm just reading them out, okay. but I will know the answers because <laughs> I'm a history major. Okay. Okay. Which was the last province to join Canada in Confederation? Newfoundland. Dina? Absolutely Newfoundland. Choice A. It was Newfoundland. Can it you name the, the year? 1949, I want to say. Yeah, that is right. Was it 1949? There we go. What do we call it? Newfoundland. Put that one on the docket. <laughs> Kevin, how quickly you answer that makes me know you're already cheating. Yeah. List. Absolutely. Question two. Okay. List. Four rights Canadian citizens have. Four rights. So we got the multiple choice? Yeah. Right to have a uh, choice A, right to have a job, vote, drive, and go to school. Choice B, school, work, bank account, travel. C, travel, live anywhere, work anywhere, get married. Or D, challenge unlawful detention, vote, apply for a Canadian passport, enter and leave oh, Canada I got freely. This. I got this. Choice E, uh, the right to watch BT <laughs> between 5.30 and 9 Dang. and PVR it and watch it all over Kevin. again. 
Uh, I'm going to go with D. I think Dina, <laughs> Dina said D as well. Correct, correct. Right, it is D. Go. Go. Who is the Queen's this. representative in Canada? Oh, that's easy. Oh, it's Kevin do we have to have the Do we have to have the uh, multiple Pro choice? Prime Minister of Canada, Premier, Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II, or the Governor General of Canada? E, Kevin Frankish. D, the Governor General of Canada. <laughs> that is <laughs> true. Let's see if there's a better one here. We're going to uh, skip to five. Question number five. What is the name of the Prime Minister of Canada and his or her party? Okay, that's, uh, that's... What do you mean? Stephen Harper, B. What there is the name go. of the Prime Minister? That's easy. Yeah. That was I was going to say Bob Ray. <laughs> <laughs> no, we weren't saying who should be the Prime Minister of Canada. We were saying who is the Prime Minister of Canada. <laughs> Well, Kevin, uh, Steve and I kid. congratulations. You're an official Canadian no, citizen. No, he's no longer after making that joke. Congratulations. <laughs> you know what, though? Honestly. You are no longer a citizen of Canada. Honestly, first office call. Uh, the Richmond Public Library actually provided some sample questions. They have a great website, and they, they, the questions come out randomly. I've done the test before. There were a lot of questions there I didn't know. They talked about Canada's uh, uh, um, native people. They talk about, uh, about uh, all sorts of things that I was like, wow, Brush I up. should know this. Brush up on our so, Canadiana. Yeah. And congratulations to anybody who's applying and also going through the same ceremony today. Welcome to this beautiful country. We'll be back with more Breakfast Television right after this. Toronto, Live from Toronto, Canada.